Come, come on over That's here, please. Sir. Oh, that. God bless you. Blessings God on bless you. you. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, sit down. I mean, us. I'm sitting here listening to you, and you're telling me that you were healed of asthma. Glory to God. Yes. Well, I want to say something. <laughs> yes. In the next few moments that we have, before we end our segment, we're going to ask you to pray for people that are watching right now yes. with asthma. Yes. Because you are. Uh, uh, such an example of what God can do. Amen. The way you're playing, how do you hold these notes? And, I mean, you couldn't do that if you had asthma. To the glory of God. He healed me at the age of 12. 12 years old? 12 years old. And it's been 24 years totally healed from asthma. So you mean one day, uh, just, it's gone? Well, you know, I was, I dealt with it for 12 years and, and I had a lot of disappointments. Uh, sitting on the bench, coaches finding out that I, that I had asthma, so they wouldn't let me play. They didn't want to have the responsibility of me having an asthma attack. Uh, friends and, and, and uh, leaving me on a basketball court because they didn't want to see me have an asthma attack. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. I wanted to keep up, but I couldn't. You know, so, but at the age of 12, because my mom took me to a, sax, to a concert and I saw a man playing the saxophone. Yeah. And it inspired me such. Oh, really? That I knew I was supposed to do it. I knew I was supposed to do it. So at the age of 12, I remembered, picked up yeah. the horn, they prayed with me. And I received God's healing at Praise that time. Praise God. Praise God. Wow. Glory to God. Well, Amen. When, when did you get saved? When did I get saved? I got saved at about 16. 16. Much after that. But so God healed me still. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Based on, on me just asking and receiving. That's right. Yeah, yeah. He, and he will do that. He, he loves us all so much. And he wants, he, he plans from before the foundation of the earth. Our, our success and our victory. What you're saying, I just, I totally love. Jeremiah 29 and 11, because yes. I know the thoughts that I think toward mm -hmm. you, saith God. And, and that, when I found out that he had such great plans uh -huh. for me, and that it didn't have to be limited by what I was dealing with, and that he would heal me. Amen. Amen. Well, you know what? Uh, as Christians, we have to receive the fact that, or accept the fact that God does heal. Yes. Okay? And there are people watching right now that are going through not only asthma, but they're going through other, other diseases or whatever. I call financial problems could be a disease too. You know, yes. whatever that is, Amen. God. Well, I want to, before we pray, because we're going to do that before we end the segment. Uh, so you, you studied the instrument. Yes. So one day you sat and you heard this, this person playing the instrument and you said, I want to do that someday. I want to do it. I was six years old at that time. Six years old. Yeah. Uh, and then did you take lessons? I took lessons and when I started in junior high school and I was so hungry to play and to emulate yeah. what I saw that it just, it, it drove me to this level that I'm at now. Okay, let's get this timeline right. When you were six years old, you saw someone and you then wanted to play the horn. Yes. And then you had this asthma. I had asthma from birth. enemy tried to attack you oh, from with. birth, so you had the asthma. Wow. Yes. Uh, yet, I see. Yet you, how did you trust the Lord? How did you come at 12 years of age? How, how did you know to trust the Lord for your healing? That's a good question. I, I grew up in church. My, my mom and dad were pastors. And so I've been, I would see the healing of, of the saints and those who believe God. And, uh -huh. and I heard the word preached and taught. So I knew that this power was available. And I knew God would do it. But I guess at, until I needed it for what I, he had called me to do, I hadn't really pulled on that, that power. Yeah. And at the age of 12, again, I, I accepted it. That's and, you know, great. he's already done it. Everything's been done for yes. us already. Yeah. It's That's been right. completed on the cross over 2,000 years ago. By his so, stripes were healed. Amen. Right? Amen. Well, I want to know, this is a technical thing now, uh, as an instrumentalist myself, when I hit a key, you know, it lasts for so long, and then you, then you got to go to the next. But what you did, I mean, that, that one note kept, I mean, oh the breathing gosh. was, how, how long, have you ever timed yourself to see how long you get hold? Mm -hmm. I really haven't. I haven't done it. But it's, it's called circular breathing. Circular breathing. Yes. How, explain that. How does it's, that work? it's the same concept as a, uh, a bagpipe player would use, and they have a, another... Uh, bag or like a third lung almost and they fill that up with air and as they take a breath they squeeze the air out of the uh, third bag and it continues the note from going. Having come out of asthma, imagine. Yeah. So, Psalm, uh, so Psalm 150 and 6 is my third lung. Let everything that have breath, praise you the Lord. Oh, praise God has God. been that third Absolutely. lung for me. Amen. I was looking at my watch thinking, I'm going to test this man and see how long he's <laughs> you know, We don't have time. I think we're going to the show, you know what I'm saying? Amen. But that's, uh, that's a gift that God has given to you. Amen. There's no doubt about that. You're, you're a family man and, and, and you serve at a wonderful, I love this title, Spirit of Faith yes. Christian Center. Yes. And, and that's in Maryland, right? That's in Maryland. Yes. And um, so you lead people at all times to into the worship experience. Mm -hmm. But right now, we need you to lead these folk that are I'm watching into the this. worship experience. So do yeah. I. I think uh, uh, to, to touch their lives for healing. We want you to look at the camera mm -hmm. and uh, Marlon, just, just pray for the healing of those who have asthma. 
Okay, that's yes. pretty prevalent now yes. in this, uh, on this earth. So yes. there, folks, and the camera uh, could be this one right yes. there, uh, or right over there, and just look at it and just pray that God, supernatural power, will heal Amen. those with asthma. Would you and do that? I sure will. We go so so many places. We're gonna man. believe with you. Amen. Amen. Right now, in the name of Jesus, I'm praying yes. with you, and I want you to agree with me as I pray. God, we thank you, Lord, that you sent your word to heal us. Therefore, any and every sickness that is out there, we can call on the name of Jesus, and it must submit, and it must be, uh, must, we must be healed by it, from it. So I thank you right now, Lord, for those who are suffering from asthma, the same very thing that I had, I was born with, and doctors said I wouldn't do anything. I thank you, Lord, right now that because you've healed me and you're no respecter of persons, you will do the same in their lives right now. And we call them healed and delivered and set free from asthma, that they'll go and do all that you've called them to do in the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. Oh, Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you. I believe we're going to get reports yes. back that... Yes. People have been healed right, yes. by the, oh, by no the, right now that. by the power Amen. of God. Because I love what you said. You said that sickness and disease has to submit yes. to the overcoming power That's right. of the healing hand of the Lord. Amen. Praise what God. What do you say about it's just a word? Sickness, Asthma is just a word, right? Anything that you can call by name is just a word, and it has to submit Amen. to the power of God. <laughs> Praise Amen. God. Amen. <sighs> I've, Cancer, anything. Allergies. I was healed of allergies, so yeah. I understand. I had those too. I was Praise delivered God. from that as well. Well, we're going to move on to our next segment. So, so as we go into the, play, just play something right here. Yeah, yeah. I and, love and the we'll song. And we'll fade into where we're going, okay? <laughs> Be right back. <laughs> 